Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to discuss about the mechanism of breathing, the basic process, how breathing is taking place in human beings. So let's first talk about the first phase or first stage of breathing that is inspiration. Inspiration we know this is the phase where we breathe in the atmospheric air into our lungs or into our body. So here in this process during the process of inspiration the lung pressure is very much less than the atmospheric pressure. So there is a negative pressure that has been developed inside the lungs. This involves the inhalation of fresh air from the surroundings. Now in case of inspiration this is an active process that means it requires energy to be performed because it involves the process of muscle contraction. Now let us study what are the various changes that is happening during the process of inspiration or when we breathe in air. During the process of inspiration the external, inter, the external intercostal muscles they start contracting. Along with this the diaphragm which is usually in the relaxed state it is dome shaped now it contracts and it becomes flattened. Here you can see the intercostal muscles it has swelled up or pushed outside because of muscular contraction of the intercostal muscles. Because of this the ribs uh, push outwards because of this contraction and in addition to that the diaphragm it has become flattened. This actually increases the volume of the thoracic chamber. Since the volume of the thoracic chamber increases because of these type of contractions, it actually increases the overall, overall pulmonary capacity or pulmonary volume. Because of this what happens, the reduction in intrapulmonary pressure which actually forces the outside air to rush through the nostrils into our lungs. Now let us talk about the next process which is known as expiration. During the process of expiration, the lung pressure is very high as compared to that of the atmospheric pressure. This means that inside the lung, there develops a positive pressure. Now here, this actually involves the expulsion of the foul air, which involves, which actually comprises of maximum amount of carbon dioxide. Now this is a passive process as it involves the process of relaxation of the muscles like intercostal muscles and diaphragm. Since this is a passive process, it does not require energy. Now let us talk about what are the different changes that is happening during the process of expiration. As compared to inspiration, what happens? The diaphragm here, it relaxes and it the dome shape that is the normal shape of the diaphragm comes back. In the other case, we are during the inspiration, we had observed because of muscular contraction, the dome shape of the diaphragm changes to a flattened shape. Now here the intercostal muscles they start relaxing because of the relaxation of the intercostal muscles what happens the ribs move inside because of these ty two types of relaxation that is happening what happens the decrease in thoracic volume due to the decrease in thoracic volume the decrease in pulmonary volume also occurs because of this decrease in pulmonary volume what happens the pressure inside the pulmonary uh, cavity or the thoracic cavity increases much more than the pressure outside. So because of this what happens it actually forces the air the foul air out of our lungs into the atmosphere. So now the if if there are additional muscles that is included in the abdominal cavity it can result to the increase in the strength of inspiration and expiration. We know that the normal a healthy human being breathe can breathe at a rate of about 12 to 16 times per minute. Now there is an instrument which is known as spirometer. This is an instrument which actually can estimate the volume of air during the process of breathing. So in this video we have discuss discussed about the mechanism of breathing. We have in detail discussed the various processes or changes that is happening during inspiration and as well as expiration also. I hope you have understood and liked this video. Thank you.